my relationship with DJ is that I have known her since we were youngsters in the magazine business. I've known DJ since the magazine started in 2004. I've known DJ Carey, I think it's like 15 years. 10, 15 years, even perhaps longer. And my relationship with DJ is twofold. I sometimes work for her, but I primarily consider myself a good friend. When I think about DJ, I think about her gigantic smile. I mean, you say hi to her and she's just, her whole face lights up. That special talent and smile that just, you know, you just love her enthusiasm. She's terrific. Warm, kind, always positive. What separates her from anybody is that she is really real and um, authentic and sincere. DJ is one of my heroes because she has been so instrumental in putting Connecticut on the map. I think there's probably an event that she goes to every night, whether it be kitchens or baths or fabrics or new design showrooms, new designers. Um, and she'll put workshops together at restaurants. She is always promoting and always looking for local. And uh, I think it's so great to be, uh, you know, to have someone who's really in touch with the community. DJ, to me, as an editor, incredibly generous and gracious and always working to bring out the best in the people that she she likes to feature. She's just a person that you can just go to for all sorts of resources. She's so smart. She definitely uh, takes the stress out of your job, uh, but she is the most professional person you'd ever want to meet. She writes the story, as I say, she produces it, and she does the editorial layout. She's been incredibly supportive of my work, but I've also seen her help many other artists that I know. DJ seeks out talent. She finds uh, the best projects, the best artisans, uh, the best suppliers, and she shares them with everybody in Fairfield County. When DJ put me on the cover of Connecticut Cottages and Gardens, um, it, it really gave me a sense of validation. It kind of not reinvigorated, but invigorated me to, to really roll up my sleeves and uh, move, go forward. One, one way DJ has helped me as a designer, really, is featuring some of my, um, and doing beautiful layouts of some of my projects. I just have had so many people call me from her stories and her editorial layouts. Um, so it's been an amazing, amazing career booster for me. I really think she's an unsung hero. She does so much behind the scenes, on the scene, uh, deeply devoted and passionate about the arts, would never say no to any ridiculous thing that I would propose. DJ's one of the best editors, and I've worked with so many over the years. Continue to work with DJ, and it's always fun. I feel that DJ is really an extraordinary person. She's very philanthropic. Her family is very philanthropic, but not in an overt way, just like kind of in her soul. And I think that really pervades all the work that she does, and I respect that in her enormously. She has done so much to support the design community in Fairfield County and beyond. DJ Carey. Congratulations, DJ. Congratulations, DJ. DJ, I appreciate our friendship and our working relationship all these years. It's been a, quite a ride with wonderful things and not so wonderful things, but we're still doing it <laughs> after all these years. I'm so proud of you. You know I always have been. I've been lucky to have you in my life for a very long time, and you so deserve this. You are a champion for so many other people, and I'm so glad that we are all able to champion you for something that you so deserve. Congratulations, DJ. Love and kisses, and thank you so much for what you do. You've done so much for all of us, so I just want to thank you from the bottom of my heart. For all the amazing work you've done over the years to support the arts in Fairfield County, you, your work has been essential, and so many artists have, are grateful for the work that you've done on our behalf. Send you all my love, and I wished I could be there. Big kiss.